Hi and welcome to List Cafe. The three terror suspects who escaped from Committee Maximum Prison on Monday, November 15th, 2021 at 1 a.m. have finally been arrested after their dramatic escape from Committee Maximum Prison, the most guarded prison in Kenya. Members of the public led detectives to the three who were hiding in Kitui County as they were headed for the Kenya-Somalia border. The Directorate of Criminal Investigations had offered up to 60 million Kenya shillings reward for anyone who would offer information leading to the arrest. 34-year-old Musharraf Abdallah, who's popularly known as Alex Shikanda, 30-year-old Joseph Juma Odiambo, and Mohammed Ali Abikar, 35, were caught in Enzio Forest in Mwingi, East Kitui County, as they approached Ukasi. The three suspects were caught courtesy of a tipper from the public. They escaped by knocking over a brick on the wall of their cell before creating a makeshift rope from blankets, strings and broomsticks, which they used to escape from the facility. Several prison officers from committee have since been arrested and some got fired over suspicions of aiding the terrorists with their plans. One of the suspects, Musharraf Abdallah Akulunga, hails from Mumias in Kakamega County. He was arrested in 2012 after a failed terror attempt targeting parliament buildings and charged with possession of explosives, ammunition and firearms. The other suspect, Joseph Juma Diambo, popularly known as Yusuf, was arrested in 2019 for attempting to enlist in the Al-Shabaab, while Mohammed Ali Abikar was arrested following his involvement with the Garissa University attack that ended the lives of several students back in April 2015. Why were these dangerous suspects released from police custody in the first place if they were involved in terror activities and they were also linked to terror groups? Kenyans have asked the Directorate of Criminal Investigations to fulfill its 60 million Kenya shillings promise to the public following the arrest of three terror suspects on Thursday, November 18, 2021. Kenyans want the people who tipped the police to get paid their money in full. Do you think the DCI will fulfill its promise and award members of the public who tipped them with the whereabouts of the terror suspects the 60 million Kenya shillings? Kindly leave us a comment below in the comment section, like this video, and kindly consider subscribing if you haven't done so, so that you don't miss out on future videos by List Cafe. See you on the next video, and bye-bye.